Scotland desperately hoping for one chance in the next four minutes. Yeah, the disappointing thing is in the last wee spell we've not really been able to walk the ball into the dangerous areas. McGinn might do now, it's just behind McLean. Dykes is there! Yeah! Chances have been few and far between. But when one arrives, Dykes made sure. And all of a sudden, it's the Tartan Army in rapturous celebrations. Three minutes from the end. It is a crucial, crucial goal in this group. What a big moment that could prove to be. It's great play from John McGinn getting into that pocket of space and then horrendous defending from Norway. And Lyndon Dykes is there to capitalise. What a goal. Nine goals for the man from the Gold Coast, for his adopted country. He's been such a big player for Scotland, Rory. You can see Ostergaard flat on the deck, bereft, big mistake, big mistake from Norway defensively. Well, and Soli Solbakken has taken off his main threat. Norway will go through these final minutes without Erling Braut Haaland. Here's Armstrong, do Scotland have something else up their sleeve here? Morganson. McTominay, if Dykes can get the flick on here, it's John McGinn. It's Dykes, it's McLean! Yeah! Oh, what a turnaround in Oslo! <laughs> this is quite sensational! Scotland have picked their moment to strike! Unbelievable scenes in the Ullaval! <laughs> they all came to see Holland, but it's Scotland who are putting on a show in the final minutes in Oslo! I said we had the overload at the back here. Dykes does brilliant just to pin Berger. And then John McGinn, rather than lashing it out, that is a brilliant goal. It really is. Dykes initially begin to pick him out and then a perfect weighted ball into Kenny McLean's path. And that is a top draw finish on his weaker right foot. Just guiding it into the corner because this is a huge moment for Scotland. And Kenny McLean, when he's stepping up to that, does not panic. And he's just sent the whole country into raptures. What a goal that is. Kenny McLean was wheeling away as he struck it. He knew it was sweet. And it has delivered the biggest hammer blow 